Dai Bingguo, former Chinese state councillor in charge of foreign affairs, said cooling down tensions in the South China Sea requires concrete efforts by all countries concerned. He made remarks on Tuesday in a keynote speech at a forum held at U.S. think tank, the Carnegie Endowment for International Peace, commenting on the upcoming ruling by the permanent court of arbitration over the case filed by the Philippines. The veteran diplomat said it is nothing more than a piece of paper. By taking a position of not participating in or accepting the attribution, China is upholding its own rights and interests under international law and safeguarding the integrity and authority of the United Nations Convention on the Law of the Sea. We hope that the U.S. can take an objective and fair approach regarding the arbitration. Rather than criticizing China for upholding the U.N. Convention, which itself has not joined, the attribution ruling, which is about to come out, amounts to nothing more than a piece of paper. But Dai also said China remains committed to a peaceful resolution of the issue through negotiation and consultation with countries directly concerned. He also said Washington should honor its promise of not taking sides on the issue and stop making speculation that China is trying to compete with the U.S. for dominance in the region. China has no intention or capability to engage in the so-called strategic rivalry with anyone. We have no ambition to rule Asia, still less the Earth. Even in the South China Sea era, we have never claimed we own the entire region. Dai called on China and the U.S. to find ways to manage their differences constructively and maintain communication on maritime issues. He said the two countries have a shared interest in keeping peace and stability in the Asia-Pacific region.